Here's a more honest look at LeBron's performance the other night in their loss against the Kings, in which he registered a negative 12, only got 7 rebounds at the center position. The Kings scored 70 points in the paint while he was playing center. He was 3 for 12 for 3 pointers, 13 of 29 for field goals, only 5 for 10 from free throws, and had a bunch of offensive fouls that didn't get called and some dirty plays. I'm sorry, but what the fuck is this? What is LeBron James doing? Fucking bad body language drama queen bitch. Fucking turn your back and throw your hips out like some goddamn overly dramatic hoe bag. Oh, fortunate switch. Oh, good news for the offense and a blow by. A blow by because you have the easy assignment on defense, LeBron bitch James. How many goats do you say that about? Oh, good. It's him. I can blow by him. Look at Mitchell's face. He's all excited when he sees who's guarding him. Oh, I've got this one easily. That's not even a particularly good move. LeBron James just sucks. Oh, I know, I know. All you LeBum fans. Oh, he's 37. It's 19th year. Well, then take him off the court. What is this, a charity league? Wait, is this the Special Olympics or something? If he's not good enough, get him off the court. Clank. Clank. LeBron, pretending like he's going to play defense, didn't actually do anything. Same dude. He is not afraid to go into the lane at all. You understand that the Kings scored 70 points in the paint, and it didn't even look difficult. Like, LeBron James at center is like a welcome mat to drive the lane. What are you going to... Oh, look at him throwing his hand. Get out of the way. I got this. I got this. Let me... Oh, my God. Look at the air ball. He actually said, clear out, clear out, so I can shoot up an air ball. That's who you all are cheering for. 21 seconds, 9 on the shot clock. Not afraid to go in the paint with that bitch-ass center. 11 seconds. Waving people around again as if he knows how to orchestrate an offense. Oh my god. That's what you came up with? No wonder the team's losing, dude. Set your teammates up for a shot to end the half. Not that garbage. Hmm. Clankety clankety. He had four other people on the floor. You ever thought about setting them up for a shot, bud? Once again, let's just go down the center because we're not afraid of the center. I will pop it right in your face. Yep. LeClank James. He's 3 for 12, uncontested. I mean, you don't you can't count that as a contest. You can't. Do you see how long he was wide open? All right, let's see how this Lakers possession gets wasted. Hey, LeBron, pretty much wide open and clankety clankety do. Look at how long he's just taking a break down the bottom right hand corner. I mean, he is taking a full blown nap. Gets the shot and clanks it. What, did you not have enough time to set up, dude? <laughs> you were there for 20 seconds. <laughs> Poor Lakers offense. Look at them all. They're just like waiting. Oh my God, LeBron just threw that out of bounds. I mean, he's responsible for that turnover. The guy barely saved it. That was a terrible pass. Did you see how depressing that was? The Lakers are just like, we're not allowed to do anything. That costs them six points if you think about it. LeBron missed the wide open man in the corner who was ready to shoot a three. The turnover leads to a three pointer for the other team at the other end. Clank, diddy clank, diddy clank got to analyze this for a minute. There's six minutes left in the game, 20 seconds left on the shot clock, and LeBron just pulls up. And it's like, oh, yeah, I mean, hey, he's got the hot hand. Why not? Except, no, he's fucking cold as ice. He's terrible, even wide open. Why are you pulling up with 20 seconds on the shot clock instead of running the offense? You are not the hot hand. Good God, the back of his head is horrifying. 
you know, it doesn't matter if that was a foul or not that we're going to call it. Fucking Christ, he's ugly. I seriously wonder how pissed he is that he spent millions of dollars making the front of his head grow back only for the rest of his head to say, nope, F you. Clankarooski, come on, man. And dirty cheap shot bitch LeBron. So here LeBron is going to clank it again. Do you know how frustrating that's got to be for the rest of the team? You know, you're going all over the place, you're working hard, and LeBron's just sitting there at the top of the key waiting for you to pass it off to him, and then he misses it. And at the end of the game, all you hear about is how it's you guys' fault and not his. So, also for the Kings game on January 12th, you can watch the entire analysis of the entire game. You can watch analysis of LeBron's dirty plays his dirty fouls and his offensive fouls and analysis of how he did in general as a center.